This is Stephanie with Ageless Living TV. Today I'd like to show you how to curl long hair using hot rollers. So are you ready for some curling tips for long hair? So my hair is this long. And I like it curly. Yes, I'm cool with the beachy waves and I might make a video on that. But this is super curly because that's my favorite, what I like. And so I say do what you like. Please yourself. So how I do that is I'm super not patient. I don't have patience, so I have to do something quick and fast and easy. So what I use is electric curlers. And this is my curler set right here. But honestly, any hot roller set will do the same thing as what I'm about to show you. And I'm going to just start. Now, these come in two sizes right in the same package. There's a medium and a large. I like the smaller curl the best since I like super curly hair. So I start with those all across the top and then as I run out, I switch to the bigger ones. So let's just see how this works. And here we go. Did you catch that? How I did that? Now, there's one way to do this. I could start at the bottom and roll it all the way up, but then I, I don't like the way that curl looks. This gives you more of a corkscrew curl. So basically, Here's how that works. I'm gonna show you on this piece right here. So you grab a big chunk of hair, not too big, not too little, just right. You grab your curler and you hold it kind of close to your head and then you just take this strand of hair and just roll it and roll it around. Now I've got the very bottom of it and I'm just gonna kind of tuck it under and do a couple of turns and there it's set and put it in there. See how that worked? Here we go. curlers they're hot and you want to be careful not to I let them get as hot as possible before I put them in my hair and I thought I would tell you how I got my hair to that point um, I washed it and I put in some hair product this is my favorite which is weird because it says straightening ultra gel a quash however I'm gonna do curly hair all I know is it makes my hair smoother and less tangly and it's one of my favorites. It's kind of an obscure product that a hairdresser used on me years ago and every time I switch to something else I go right back to this. So I love it. And then I, when my hair is wet, I wrap it in a towel. Yes, I've read the articles that towels are damaging to your hair, but I'm careful. I wrap it in a towel and I use two full towels and that's just the best way to get my hair somewhat, somewhat dry before I put the hair dryer on it. And uh, so two towels is my secret. Three if you're in a hurry. <laughs> and then the other thing that I do is I use a blow dryer and I start at the roots. I start at the roots, but I have my hair upside down because I like that little bit of lift. My hair is long and heavy, so it's going to be flat pretty much no matter what I do, but just that little bit of lift. So I always dry my hair upside down. Okay, I'm ready. My curlers are not warm, not warm at all. So they're totally cooled off. So there you have it. I'm just going to take them out. Ah, they're all out. So this is just the curls that I have. So I like to just kind of mess them up a little bit. So you kind of just, you, you might even take them one at a time and maybe separate them out. I just kind of run my fingers through it a little bit and kind of fluff it. And sometimes I even will turn my head upside down and fluff it, but I don't want the curls to come glom them all together, so I don't. So that's pretty much, that's pretty much it. That's what I do. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I hope you got a good tip out of this, and I hope you're enjoying your curly long hair.